In today's news, researchers beam a light particle across a fiber network. Apple's new home app will change the way you light your house. And fluorescent light boosts testosterone levels in men. Lux Today for Tuesday, September 27th starts right now. teleportation scene in Star Trek is slowly becoming a reality, although transporting Starfleet officers from one planet to another might still be a ways off. Researchers at the University of Calgary have successfully moved a photon light particle over a four-mile straight line, setting a record for quantum teleportation. The photon was transported using a fiber optic cable, and the research team based their design on quantum entanglement. This is when two photons are joined together so that they cannot be split up. The researchers then sent a photon to Calgary's City Hall while it stayed entangled with its photon double at the university. It was sent back and forth again. The successful long-distance teleportation will move scientists a step closer to developing a secure quantum internet sometime in the distant future. Teleportation from one room to the other could be helpful in the home in the future, but for now, we have Apple's new Home app. This new app is able to control all the smart devices in your house. The new platform, which will be a part of Apple's iOS 10 update, allows you to group together devices in one room so you can control them all with a single command. Home will allow you to create an interplay between different smart devices, meaning you can set a smart living room light switch to not only turn on your lights, but also to raise the blinds or lock the door. Apple's new app also allows you to control your smart lighting via the Siri button on your Apple TV remote. This means you can turn off the lights while watching a movie without moving, an innovation that couch potatoes will love. From the living room to the bedroom, Scientists from the University of Siena in Italy have discovered that sitting in front of a light box can increase male testosterone levels. The study was comprised of 38 men, half of whom were exposed to a full-strength fluorescent light box. A secondary group were exposed to an adapted box that was wired to produce significantly less light. The participants received doses of light for an hour during the early morning for two weeks straight. The scientists discovered that the men exposed to the bright, unregulated light were found to have increased levels of testosterone compared to those who were exposed to the adapted box. Light boxes are often used to treat seasonal affective disorder, which is a depression that strikes during the winter months when the hours of available daylight are at their lowest. The scientists believe that the light box exposure inhibits the pineal gland in the center of the brain, which prompted the noted increase in testosterone production. That wraps things up. Remember, you can get all the latest lighting news globally, 24 hours a day at luxreview.com. I'm Courtney Ferguson for Lux Today. We'll see you back here at the same time next week.